uh, thank you so much. I think it's uh, th those type of awards is uh, is a consequence of uh, the way the team is playing, the way everybody around is uh, is running an extra mile this season in order to to keep uh, growing as a team, to keep writing a good history about ourselves. Mm -hmm. And so far, everything is coming together in the first part of the season. This is just the beginning. Uh, we want uh, much more, obviously. Uh, but at the same time, of course, uh, I'm glad to to get this type of uh, honors, let's say, because, it's, like I said, it's a sign of uh, the things are going well for the team. What's made the difference, though, coach? Uh, probably is... Uh, is not only one reason, not only one factor, as usually. But if if I have to highlight uh, one of them, I think is a is a change of mentality uh, within the group among ourselves. And and when I say ourselves, I will include also our fans. Um, the change of mentality, the confidence that the team is showing, probably. Coming from from the last stages of uh, the past season, uh, specifically coming probably from the last game of the season, the final we played, uh, the NetBank final, uh, the resilience that the team showed on that day, uh, having the capacity to 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 came back in, in a game against uh, against uh, Mamelodi Sundowns to conquer that trophy. It was a really good way to start uh, the current season uh, from that moment. And I think uh, right now the team is playing with a high level of confidence. It doesn't matter what's happening in the game, if we are doing the things right or wrong or somewhere there in the middle, even for the fans, even when the things are not coming together, everybody's still believing that we can make it. And and that's probably the the biggest uh, biggest change in, in our team right now. So it, it won't surprise you, though, that not only just Jose Rivero's winning the coach of the month, three of your other players, Relem Fugeng, mm. Sipo Chain, Dion Hotto, all of them nominated, obviously losing out to Lucas Ribeiro, who then won it, mm. uh, who's been fantastic this season. What does that say, though, about the collective? Uh, I, I can't remember a time when coach wins and then three other players also get nominations. What does that say uh, again? And I'm not trying to repeat the question, but it's a different kind of form of application when you get acknowledged by not only the, the commentators, the, you know, the scribes in terms of the journalists, but the three players themselves. I mean, it's, it's a different Dion Hotto as well. Uh, attractive football, probably. I think that's, that's the key. You can win. There's many ways to win the games. In the end of the day, it's the most important thing. We, we all want to win games and competitions, especially our fans. But the way you try to make it possible is your decision. And we're trying to play an attractive football, a football where our our talented players can can express themselves, like I said already so many times. And uh, that's the reason why the people is going to the stadiums in around the world to, to have the possibility to, again, to identify yourself with a winning project but at the same time to have a couple of good hours where you can really enjoy yourself, enjoy with your team, enjoy with your players and the players that you mentioned before in different positions with different responsibilities, different different roles and many others around, I will say. Uh, they are, they are uh, giving the people what they are looking for when they are coming to the stadium. So I guess that's, that's the reason behind. 